asking how to start a snow cone business, um, you've come to the right video. I can help you out with this. My name is Brando Linick, and I appreciate you for connecting with me here. When it comes to a snow cone business, um, there's a lot of ways you could approach this. A lot of people I know who have done this, um, including a close friend of mine who had helped out, they actually started mobile with a trailer and they had a truck, so they just attached the hitch to it and they're off on their way going around the city where I live and they're doing this. Now, the thing is, with this business model, in this review, this is a review here, you got to keep in mind it's a weather permitting business. So if it's hot out, you might get a lot of customers. Even if it's not hot out, you still might get customers. But if it's horrible out, you're probably not going to get any customers, which means you're not going to be in business for that day. So it's kind of a, a strategically planned out business model that you have to go by when it comes down to this. And having seen my friends start one because they wanted to start a business really that was simple, one to make money. I'm telling you, if you're looking at this for very similar reasons, to start a simple business to make money, all right? dealing with sometimes having foot traffic, a lot of traffic, a lot of you know people coming by and looking and checking out your snow cone business and then sometimes no people whatsoever. Even though it's not as consistent and reliable, I would suggest to you, even sometimes it is consistent and reliable, I would suggest to you before you consider going down this road, if you're looking at this for similar reasons why my friend was looking at it, start a simple business to make money, to be your own boss, to quit your job, all right, if you hear me out here for a minute, I've got a lead I want to throw your way uh, before you decide to take on supplies, equipment, employees, moving from different location to location or having a storefront and then dealing with the time you got to put in to maintain it and run it before you head down that path. Uh, my story and experience with this goes back just over a year ago, it was like September 2014, um, I was working and building a traditional business and it was crazy dealing with supplies, equipment, employees, all that stuff and put it off to the side because I came across a person and they shared with me some information on how they were getting results with their business and they were building a business in a way where they were not, they were not doing any cold market prospecting, they weren't chasing friends and family, they weren't even creating their own product and service. And because they were doing this on the internet, building a business from home, which is not average or typical results, I'll repeat that, they were building a business online from home, not creating average or typical results, attracting people to them every day, all right, and building multiple six figures. Because of this, I started to model and copy them. In less than about three months period of time, I created a full-time income business for myself working part-time. Again, not average or typical results. I'm sharing that with you to share with you what's possible, really, because if you're wanting to build a business to be your own boss, and I re-emphasize this, because if you're wanting to do it to be your own boss, to create your own income, I would encourage you learn to build a business on the internet. Learn to build a business where it can do the heavy lifting for you, where you don't need supplies, equipment, employees, a store space, or moving from location to location. All right, Do it in a way where you can go to any location you want, even in a country you don't speak the language, and still maintain and grow your business right from your laptop. It's the best, most profitable, massive thing you could do. So that's just my tip. That's my overview. I hope you enjoyed this little you know, review as much as they put together for you. If it made sense to you from a business perspective and uh, you like this kind of stuff and would like to learn more information about building a business online from home, you can always check out my site after. It's 123marketingtips.com. I'll put the link in the description below. Uh, heads up, you will see a video there from myself explaining exactly how I've done this and how you can do it too. You'll also be introduced after that from myself uh, to my business partner, my good friend and mentor who shared this with me going back like 2014, September 2014, and sharing with you how they're traveling currently and building a business too. So appreciate you regardless of if you decide to connect with me or not. I look forward to seeing you at the top and seeing you on the beaches of the world. Take care.